Good morning. Happy Friday morning. I'm here at the sand dunes with my son. Um, we did get a little bit of a late start on our hike this morning. But I wanted to get on here and talk about false accusations. Um, how do you handle being falsely accused of something? <laughs> and what are some ways that you can take those experiences and turn them into positive experiences for yourself? Um, I have some pretty good ideas and things that I've been practicing. Um, I've had people just within the last six months or so, different people accuse me of doing things that I wouldn't do. And if I had, I would have straight up said that this is what I did and owned it. But what I did is instead of trying to get them back or even argue with them over it, I let them allow themselves to be right because they didn't have the love and respect enough to come to me and ask me if it was true. They just straight lashed out and said that I did. <laughs> did something that I didn't do. Um, and I took that experience, those experiences, and I decided, and it really it just dawned on me more than decided, <laughs> that when people falsely accuse me of stuff, all that it does is makes me want to set up strong, healthy boundaries with that person to stay away from them. But then, in all of my other experiences with all of my other relationships, it only makes me more loving and more compassionate and more caring. And it just makes me want to do more for those that do have the love and respect enough to come and ask me and communicate with me before they just decide that that's what I did by God and they're just again accuse me of it and assume. So I challenge you guys to take those kinds of experiences. If someone falsely accuses you of something, set up your boundary with them. And if you feel like, you know, you need to walk away and get away from them. But then use that as a stepping stone to do better in your own life. To become even more loving and more compassionate and more caring. And to expand your mind to allowing yourself to do more for those that you love. And allow yourself to know that those people who don't have enough love and respect for themselves to come to you and talk to you and communicate to you before they just accuse you. <laughs> just let them go. <laughs> they don't love you. It's not about you. None of it is about you. When someone accuses you of something that you didn't do without talking to you first or even giving you any kind of opportunity to use your own voice to say your own truth, let them go. They're just an anchor holding you down from where you really want to be. And you know what? When you can let them go and allow yourself to grow, to be more loving, more compassionate, and more caring for the relationships that you have, all they're doing is helping you strengthen your relationship with yourself and those that really do care about you. I hope you guys have an awesome day. Um, I'm going to go ahead and hike around these sand hills with my son and enjoy my morning.